We here at Samsung Mobile would like to introduce the Galaxy S4, our next generation handset device that's designed to bring people closer together and enrich everyday life. Let's check out the S4's design. It's really thin, only 7.9 millimeters. It's also light. The bezel is strikingly small. Check out the elegant pattern on the backside. The S4 is currently available in black and white. The S4 not only looks great, but it's also powerful. With a 2600 milliamp hour removable battery, you can do more without having to recharge the phone. The S4's 5 inch Full HD Super AMOLED display is vivid and immersive. Even though the screen is larger than the S3, the body is actually smaller. Let's see how a video looks on the S4. The colors are vibrant and natural. You can really see the difference. I'll open up a browser. The S4 is a 441 PPI resolution. It's very defined. You can also customize a lock screen to add a message. My New Year's resolution this year was to stay fit, so I want my phone to remind me of that every day. Great. That's a more personalized lock screen. Here's a cool light effect when I hover my finger over the screen. Now let's look at the home screen. This is the default settings. But you can also customize the home screen by prioritizing the notifications. Here you can see all the options. I like to use multi-window and air gesture, so I'll put those at the front. The Galaxy S4 is equipped with an impressive 13 megapixel camera. Let's see it in action. The first thing that you'll notice is an impressive array of options to create all kinds of fun and innovative shots. Samsung Mobile incorporated the best features from the Galaxy camera to make this the most complete camera experience. Let's start with Sound and Shot. Jay here is a great drummer. With Sound and Shot, I can take a picture and record 9 seconds of audio before or after taking the photo to make it more meaningful. Okay, let's see the result. You can remember those moments exactly as they happened. Animated photo is another cool camera setting. I can animate a photo and make a GIF without needing a third party app. Here's Jisun doing funny things with her hands. So I took the picture, and now I just color in the part that I want to remain still. All right. Let's see the result. That's a cool GIF. My favorite camera function is Drama Shot. Esther here is a really good dancer, and with Drama Shot, I can capture her movements in a continual time lapse photo. It's important to keep the camera still. I'll grab the frames I want to keep, or remove the ones I don't like, to produce the best result. So let's see what it looks like. That's fun. The Galaxy S4 is equipped with a dual camera, where the front and rear camera can be used simultaneously. Let's see how this works. So now, in the little picture, you can see me, and in the big picture, you can see this amazing meal that I created. You can also reverse it, so now it's switched. Let's put it back to how it was before. So there's many settings you can choose from as well. There's fisheye, there's window, for the true romantics there's even heart shape. The one I like is instant pick. Because with instant pick, you can have the date below, 
and give your picture a more classic touch. So let's resize it a little. Perfect. That's a nice photo. It's wonderful to see photos on this vivid screen, but there's nothing like seeing pictures in an actual album the old-fashioned way. With Story Album, the S4 lets you order and print a beautiful physical photo album and send it to your home. I've taken some great photos of Seoul that I want to print. I can search for them by using the location tag, so I just type in Seoul, and select it. I can also search for pictures by the time they were taken, or who was tagging them. I'll call the album Fun in Korea. There's many themes to choose from, but I like scene. So now I can see all the pictures that I've taken of Seoul. I really like this one, so I'll put that in the cover. So this is what the album will look like. And to order the album, I click on Order Photo Book, fill in my details, and that's it. Another fun Galaxy S4 feature is group play. I can share music, pictures, documents, or games directly to other S4 phones that are in the same room. Let's see how it works with music. So I'll choose this song that I like. And now the song is being projected on the other phones. I can control which phone acts as left or right speaker to make all sorts of cool effects. You can also use group play to share pictures. So I'll select these. And now you can see them on the other screens. So I'll write a special message and share that with the other phones. The Galaxy S4 is equipped with motion and gesture sensors that have several useful applications. For instance, with Air Gesture, you can interact with your phone without touching it. This is practical if your hands are dirty while cooking. With Air View, I can preview pictures, emails, videos, or a browser by just hovering over with my finger. So let's see how it works on video. So I can preview another scene by just hovering over. There's the scene I'm looking for. Easy. My favorite AirView application is Speed Dial. By hovering over, I can see my friend's numbers and call. Very simple. S-View Cover is an accessory that makes using your phone more convenient. It has a transparent cover, and I can use the phone with the cover still on. Oh look, Rachel's calling me. Very practical.
Now I'll show you how Smart Pause works. It's a cool feature that lets you easily control the screen by where you look. As you can see, the video stops playing when I look away. And then it keeps playing. Pause. Play. Pause. Play. Let's look at Watch On, a service that transforms your S4 into an IR remote. I'll show you how to set it up. Select your country. Type in your zip code. Choose your provider. Now you can turn on your TV and see what's on. So I'll choose this show. And from the S4, I can change the volume or change channels. The S4 empowers you to live a healthier life and take care of your well-being. S Health can be used to monitor and share your workouts and nutrition, and measure the temperature and humidity levels of your environment. I set a goal to walk 10,000 steps a day, and here I can see how I'm doing. So here you can see the steps, distance I've ran and the calories I've burned. So here I can review my progress today. And also this week. Or see my progress since last week. I can also have the S Health widget on my home screen to make it easier to monitor. Thank you for watching the hands on video. I hope this has been helpful to learn more about the Galaxy S4. Be sure to check out Samsung Mobile's YouTube channel to see more videos about the S4 and other Samsung Mobile products.